now between Henry Cejudo and Conor McGregor. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, the only simultaneous two-division champion in UFC history, and really a guy who has taken the sport by storm. His win over Jose Aldo, Nate Diaz, most recently Eddie Alvarez. Remarkable what McGregor has accomplished in a short time in the UFC. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. So here he is, folks, the 2008 Olympic gold medalist in freestyle wrestling, Henry Cejudo, challenged Demetrius Johnson for the UFC Flyweight Championship. When he has tried to take down an opponent in the UFC, he's been able to do so. That includes Mighty Mouse. We really, though, have seen a boxing-heavy attack in the UFC. Outstanding hand speed on the Phoenix, Arizona native, Henry Cejudo. This guy is a wrestler. He has an outstanding power double, excellent singles, Beautiful throws, and if he can get this fight to the ground, his ground and pound is devastating. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. McGregor is 29, Cejudo is 30. McGregor is five inches taller. He will have a 10-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. It's the first fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the And now to his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Greco world wrestler and holding a professional record of 13 wins, two losses. He stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Phoenix, Arizona, Henry the Messenger Zahudo! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, third team. Herb Dean, our third man in the octagon for this one. And with that, we are underway from the United Center here in the... Wow! Oh, he might be out. Oh, big left. That one hurt. Stand up. Wow! He's gotten hurt here. Oh! Huge right hand! Boom! Shin to the dome. He's down! Another takedown attempt here. Nice takedown. Half guard. done reversal two minutes have expired in our opening round pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Sahuda. he does have full guard here which is still dangerous McGregor gets back up again 
in. Nice kick right there. Well, his opponent's got the lead now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. Finds his range with the jet. Good right hand on the top. He's hurt. He's hurt. He's hurt. This could be it. Beautiful takedown. So Gregor gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Good punch. And back up again. Very swung over the haymaker. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Connor. Oh, there's a leg kick. Another vicious kick from McGregor. Yes, Joe, I would agree with you there. Going to the body there with the right kick. Oh, nice jab by Cejudo. He continues to evolve as a striker. Nice hammer fist. The horn sounds for the end of round one. And there is the horn. He survives to see another round, but multiple knockdowns there. Big round from Conor McGregor. Total domination, and his opponent should be credited for getting through that round at all. He took some brutal shots. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. when you throw the same technique over and over and over again. Hard inside leg kick lands. Oh. Looks like it did start him a little bit. Oh, he's out. He's out. And just oh. like that, the fight is over. A huge kick for the knockout victory. Oh, that was a no-doubter, Joe. That might even impress the likes of Edson Barboza. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent tonight. He couldn't have caught him much more flush than that, Joe. Full force. Beautifully extends the leg right to the target, and that is the end of... Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 28 seconds of round number 2. He's going to win by knockout, the no So, and still your UFC lightweight champion, the notorious Conor McGregor, finding a way yet again, seemingly with the odds stacked against him, to get his hand raised. He has had doubters every step of the way, and he has muted nearly all of them at this point in time. Big stage, bright lights, and yet again, the brightest star, the notorious Conor McGregor. Congratulations on a big win here tonight. Yo, 